Hi everybody, and welcome to Simple Drinks. On this episode of Simple Drinks, we show you how to make an awesome lemonade. Trust me, you're not going to want to miss out on this awesome lemonade. So for this lemonade recipe, you're gonna need seven normal sized lemons. Um, I like my f a lemon flavor to be strong, that's why I'm using seven lemons. But if you, you like yours to be medium, then just use five lemons. And if you like to, like the lemonade to taste like um, lemon infused water, then by all means just use four normal sized lemons. Now this is for a normal sized pitcher. Also, you're going to need dried or crushed mint. This is found at normal grocery stores and um, you're going to be needing about a tablespoon of that. A squeezer, a lemon squeezer. You can use a fork or electric squeezer or like me, a hand squeezer. A pitcher and 10 tablespoons of sugar. So I'm just really quick going to demonstrate how to use a hand squeezer. So basically you're just gonna push in the lemon and turn. And when you're done with all seven or five or four of your lemons, um, I'll tell you what to do next. So now that you're done squeezing your lemon, I don't know if you guys can see, but um, that's a lot of lemon juice. Um, you're going to pour it all into your pitcher, just like so. Um, now we, now um, we have to put the water in. Now there isn't really an exact measurement for the water, but all I'm going to say is that how much lemonade you want is how much water you're going to put. So if you want lemonade up to here, you put water up to here. So I'm going to put some water and I'll see you guys. So I filled my pitcher up with water, it's about up to here, and now I'm going to add in my sugar and crush the mint. So if you're on a diet, um, you can put honey instead of sugar or do half-half. And let me remind you that it is 10 tablespoons of sugar. So we're going to pour all that sugar in and you have to mix it in. So mix it, mix it, mix it really well because if you do not mix it well, then it's just going to be a bunch of granules of sugar everywhere and it's going to taste like granules of sugar, which will not be very good. Next up, I'm going to add my dried mint, dried or crushed mint, whatever you want to call it, and give that a stir. Now, your lemonade is done. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this recipe. If you did, make sure to give us a thumbs up, big thumbs up. Comment down below what else you want us to make, and make sure to subscribe for more awesome videos. Thank you, and bye!